Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov. I'm a math teacher, and today we're going to answer the question, what are the three-dimensional shapes called? The first three-dimensional shape that we're going to look at is a rectangular solid. And a rectangular solid is a four-sided three-dimensional shape comprised of all rectangles. The way we draw one is you draw a rectangle, and then draw another one that's somewhat inside of the other, and then you just connect the lines. So what you see is this and this rectangle are equal, the top and the bottom, and the back and the front are all equal. A subcategory of a rectangular solid is a cube. Now a cube is a rectangular solid, and in this case, all of the faces are the same. So left, right, front, back, and top and bottom are all equal to each other. So other kinds of uh, three-dimensional shapes are cylinders, which has a circular base and a height. So you basically are stacking circles one on top of the other. And the last one we're going to look at today is the tetrahedron. And a tetrahedron is a four-sided shape comprised of all triangles. So think of a pyramid. And there would be one in the back, and then a triangular base. So this would be a four-sided uh, triangular shape called the tetrahedron. Bigger shapes would be a pentahedron, all the way up to a dodecahedron. And so I'm Charlie Kasov, and today you've learned the three-dimensional shapes in geometry. Thank you.